Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel is Take and thanks for watching my channel and subscribing supporting me guys. I hope you guys all are fine and also feeling fine and today I'm going to say one as take that BSOD problem. What is BSOD? That is blue screen of death. This is called blue screen of death problem, okay? This causes by your OS file crashes or have installed new application in your system or an issue in your hard disk, hard disk drive okay that causes this problem okay guys how to fix this okay these are the two scenario if you are able to go to the desktop okay after after this problem after showing this problem if you are able to log in your PC to the desktop you can try it from the desktop too or if you are not able to log in your computer okay just showing this problem only then you have to try another method okay okay I'm going to share from the login PC now okay this is the my active PC and what you have to do is go to the start button click here after we have to search there, reset R E S E T reset PC. Now to click there, reset PC. Now you can find out that advanced startup, right? This is the next scenario, okay, to go to the advanced repair tool. After sorting down your computer, then what you have to do is again press the power button. Okay, when it comes the Windows icon there blinking, then after forcefully press the shut down button about three times. Okay, yes, it's time now. Press the power button forcefully, shut down it. Again, restart. Again, do the same. Press the power button and shut down forcefully. Again, press the power button. It is testing the memory from my Dell laptop. I am going to press escape here. Going on the preparing automatic repair, ok. is diagnosing in your PC yeah now you can go to the advanced option okay yeah this is the number two method to go to the advanced repair option okay if you cannot go to the advanced repair option from this two method We have to try from the USB bootable USB pen drive. Okay, what you have to do is you have to be your pen drive. Then after you have to make bootable from the OS, and after insert in your computer, and after boot from your pen drive. Okay. Okay, now restart your computer. First, you have to or del key to go to bus menu zoom it then I'm 
go to the boot sequence okay then I'll first select the USB storage at the first okay then after click the exit this is the my Dell laptop okay press any key to boot okay click the next button here you can find all the repair your computer okay and click there yes and so you can go to the advanced repair option okay guys Now you can try from the start of repair too. Okay, if not fixed, then try from the start of setting. Okay, start of setting. From the start of setting, you can boot your system in safe mode. Okay, click restart. Try this from. It's restarting the computer. Okay, to start a computer in save mode, you have to find out there phone number is for the save mode. Okay, read the phone number from your number pad. The windows start on the save mode. Okay, guys. Yes, it's done. Okay. Okay, then after if no problem not fixed, then after try from the next method. Just restart it, then after it automatically start in normal mode. Start anyway. If you have a system restore, then click there and click the Windows 10. Click the next button here is I have and click next and click the finish okay it will restore system okay now back go to the troubleshooter I'm trying from this command prompt click there okay from here Build input break space for slash fix MBR. Then I'll hit enter. Then I'll tap there. Build input break space for slash. Then I'll fix boot. Fix. B O T boot at enter. Okay, access is denied. No worry. Now try the next command. There is B O T boot S E C T sector space for slash enter and T sixty space S Y S. Okay, but set space for slash and 60 and so yes then we hit enter okay then after what you have to do is type there and be able to boot rc work space for slash it's good hit enter Okay, hit enter. 
dengan Q charger SFC space forceless scan now C scan and now double now right enter okay it takes a time okay now it's complete then after what you have to do is again next command that is csk csk sorry dsk okay csk dsk space c colon okay now hit enter it checks okay all the files corrupted files and fix it it takes a few time okay you have to wait too it's going on progress yeah it's finished okay now what you have to do is exit exit then press enter then click the continue okay okay this solution fix your problem then after it's okay if not fixed and then after what you have to do is you have to reinstall new ways on your hard disk drive okay after installing the OS, if the same problem occurs, then after you have to change your hard disk and replace the next hard disk, okay? And from this problem will be solved, guys. Okay? Well, friends, if this solution really helped you to solve your problem, then let me know in the comment box and don't forget to support me, guys. One support inspires me to create more videos about this type of issue. Okay, friends thanks for watching and stay safe thanks for watching bye